Now what you're going to do, uh, Connor, you're going to yoke them. So you're going to come in the middle, mm. you pick the yoke up, you put it over their necks, mm -hmm. then the U-bars, you basically going to slot it underneath and, and push that in. Sweet. That's what you're going to do. That's what I'm going to do. Would you hold my camera? Yeah, I can't do it. Oh, I know. Well, oh, it's finishing. Do you want me to continue? Connor is on a crash course to drive the oxen because he's going to be driving them, hopefully, in Radadesh, our Belgian farm. Mm. <coughs> we hope. And Nicola's going to be supervising him. <laughs> The yoke that we're using, actually all our yokes are homemade, this is basically laminated plywood sheeting. If you can get uh, laminated plywood sheeting. Situation. Actually, I'm going to put this uh, one one down, uh, Connor. Oh, okay. I don't want it quite so. Uh, I want number two. Number two hole. Oh, I'm upset up there. Major hole, mate. Really cool. Obviously. That's why you're having difficulty for number three. It's number two? Number two hole. Number two hole. That's it. Put it down. Okay, now these ropes here. This goes, there's a bit, well basically what it is, there's a loop there and a long chain. Look at this chain, it's about, that, that, that's how long the chain is. Hmm. So, give you a good, a good idea how long the chain is. Yeah, it's the length of the yeah. person around it. And it's looped, basically, basically. Loop, a little, little wooden, little uh, ring there. And this goes behind the horns and behind the ears, mm -hmm. but in front of the yoke. Both sides. What we do, we get the hook, thread it through the ring, mm -hmm. take the slack here, not, not take, I take mm. the slack here, uh. hook it on. Okay. Now your side, you pull the pull it down so you take the slack off. Okay, now now you thread it through and hook it back on itself so it's not hanging down and it's not pulling tight. Yeah. Is that comfy? Wait a bit too. Okay. What's the story? He's going to finish 12. Okay. 12 okay. o'clock. Yeah. He's happy. Okay. Get these two walks now then. Yeah. Let's, let's see how we go. Where's she going? It's cool. You start oh, doing this. The gates open. And you realize, wait a minute, this is a living creature I'm doing right. this to. Right, now send me, the, send me the one now. This is yours. Yeah. Behind the ears. The arse. Stand there. Behind the Put it behind the ears, but in front of the yoke. <coughs> what I suggest is do the furthest one first, the furthest chain first, because that way you can actually see easier what you're doing. Thread it through, find a convenient place to hook it on, not too, not too far, because you have to adjust it on that side. Okay, that's it. That one, get the slack out. A bit more, a bit more. Okay, that's fine. Mm. It's 
So I may have the, I may have the race horses. <laughs> you also enter those into the Grand National. And that's it. They're both yoked up now. That's it. You know. So if you uh, go behind, I think you come around, Nicola, and get your accelerator. You want uh, horsepower? Should you turn it off now. And, and your spreader. Sorry, not your spreader. Thanks. A trailer. <laughs> So you have a, a thing of tea <coughs> back there, and you bring your trailer, come down the side of the barn, and pop over there. Oh, you're sitting in the barn. you got Connor. Well, you obviously all the baby looks like Connor. Mm. Mm. Yeah, she's my baby. Oh, because we've got to find a buggy in the trailer. Yeah, you need my buggy. Yeah, you turn it off now.